This is, I've got the high end day 1.1 get 2005. This is the old radio to cut, you can see where the washer is dented in, and it's actually larger, become larger than the new cap I'm going to put on. But it's very important that you replace this cap and you see that there's the actual rubber stretching and drooping over the sides, so it's not able to contain the coolant anymore. It doesn't do its job, you lose coolant that way, it slips into the air, so it's advisable to change it. When you see in that sort of condition, I see you lose, losing coolant, that will be the culprit. Very, it's a very important part. Before you do anything major, check the radiator cap. If it looks like this, that will be the culprit. That will be the problem. It has to look nice, smooth, clean, and make sure you get the correct one with the, that mine is a 0 0.9 bar. And this is also, 0.9 bar and then you must get the correct pressure in it. That's, that's when it releases the, the valve on top the valve release and the, and the coolant gets compressed the coolant comes out from here the air comes out from here and condenses into the expansion tank but without doing the job you're just going to lose coolant you're going to get overheating engine and it just won't do its job so basically it's only a 9 quid part. I got it from eBay. I got it from Amazon, so thank you very much for watching.